Hi guys, I'm Lynn with Soft Squares. Today we're going to open a subscription bag from Vicky at Creative Notions. Let's see what month is in there and what fun things are in here. All right, um, she's had a little bit of a hiccup going on over at her shop. Uh, she's a little behind. She's trying to get caught up. So. Please be patient with her. But what's so cute <laughs> is it's August and our little bag looks like winter. Snowmen and stuff like that. And maybe it was supposed to be like a Christmas in July theme. I don't know, I just think it's adorable. So let's get in there. This is a monthly subscription bag that you can get through creativenotionsquiltshop.com. Please, when you go there to sign up, tell her you heard about her from me. I don't have a unique link, but it helps her to know where you're coming from, and it uh, helps me. So, when I open it up, look what I see inside. Bees. Really cute. She has these bags made for her. They all have her little camper logo on them. And the cool thing is the bag is reusable, so you can use it however you want, but it's fabric, nice quality with the drawstring. And she said you can add it to your stash and cut into it if you want. So it's however you want to use it, but they're really nice. So this is a, a subscription bag for quilters. It has all kinds of things in there. Let's just pull everything out and start at the top. And then it says, due to shipping delays, we will be having our giveaway on Friday, August 25th at 3. Just a little note. So we'll probably learn more about that when I find the pamphlet. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, fabric. Fabric. <laughs> There's stuff tucked down in here, and this is a honey stick. Evidently, there's more than one. <laughs> okay, so, um, sunflower, quilt, and table runner. And by all the little bees on the little bag, I'm not surprised to see things with honey. May sunflower sweet. So this is the May bag. I did get an email that said, or a, actually I think I saw it on social media, that they are hoping to do a really quick turnaround. They just got everything for the next bag. So as soon as they get things put together, that one is shipping. So anyway, each month she does a contest in five different categories, and then she gives each of those winners the equivalent of a jelly roll. And the project winner is Gloria Knorr's. Scrap winner is Cindy Waters Tolly. Block winner, Angela Stuttgartner. Recipe winner, Valerie Maschino. Guest winner is Angela Shippey. I'm not very good at reading names. I'm sorry if I butchered your name, but if I read your name, you need to collect your prize by emailing Vicki at info at creativenotionsquiltshop.com. All right, so the nice thing is she tells you the contents of the bag and the value of it. Um, oh, right off the bat, the total bag value is $85. Okay, so we get eight fat quarters, which I'm going to open up separately, but I can see all kinds of things tucked in here. All kinds of things. And I already found the honey sticks that fell out. I guess I'll find out if there's more when I open it. These are so pretty. Okay, so we'll look at that closer in just a minute. But that's a $28 value, 28. And there's usually eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. We get a curved yellow handheld scissors. Oh, nice. So these are our scissors that she has made for her. They have her little branding on there, but they're curved. Can you see how this comes up right here? It's not, they're not flat, they come up. These are great for doing with embroidery or applique. And I have a feeling we're gonna need them for this, but they're yellow and they're cute. Next, oh, that's $9 value. Next we have a three and a half and a four and a half hexagon ruler set. Aha, here we go. 
And then it gives you the instructions on how to use the hexagon. And just like with the circles, she's included a little plastic ring that will open up and you can add your pieces to it to keep everything together. And it looks like it has the triangle pieces and the hexagon for both sizes and maybe even a bonus one in here. I see three, three things. Okay, so we have the four and a half inch hexagon. We have the three and a half inch hexagon. And we have the triangle that is for the four and a half inch. So they're color coded, but it goes right here. Okay, and then here is the one for the three and a half, and it actually says right on it, plus they're, they're coordinating, right? So there's that piece, it goes right there. But there's this one. This says a two and a half inch side triangle. So either I need it for this project, or I got the other one I don't remember, or it accidentally got in my bag. I'm not sure what it is, but it, it came with all five pieces and the plastic ring. And the ring opens up like this. You put all your pieces on and then you can hang on to it. Includes two and a half inch triangle for previously sent two and a half inch hexagon. I'm going to have to look for that. So we already have the two and a half inch hexagon if you've been getting these bags already. I'm sure I have it handy, just not off the top of my head. Okay, <laughs> so we have that. That set right there is $16. We also get a pre-cut embroidered bee border. And look how cute this is. It's already embroidered on. It has these little bees and flowers. And on the quilt, that's what goes around here. So she has given us five four and a half by 41 inch strips. That's a lot. How cute. Super cute, oh my goodness. I'm just wowed every time I open her bags. Okay, so there's that, and as you can see, it's running around the quilt pattern. Oh, the borders are, pre-cut embroidered bee borders are $15. We also get the sunflower quilt and table runner pattern, which I keep holding up. This is $10. And so here's the table runner, here's the quilt, and I said they've given us the fabric for the borders. Just still in awe. Okay. Uh, we also get a subscriber pattern and block. And they've used, is that what this is? Extra ideas to use subscribers completion blocks. So we have just a different pattern that they've come up with. Looks like rail fence and the, um, oh, there, I lost my mind. Anyway, there, hexagon, little, um, why can't I cannot think what these are called? Snowballs, snowball blocks. All right, so there's a bigger closer up picture of the hat and the snowball blocks. Very cute. So this is another idea, something you can do. Um, this is a block of the month competition and this is the block. It has the two daisies and the, the um, rail fence blocks that make up one block. And that's how they've put it together here and using the fabric that she sent out. This is what it would look like. And then if you want, you can round the corners and do this. So it's just another variation which is nice because it's just fun to see different options. And then she's even given us cutting instructions on how to get the most out of the fabric. All right, uh, cute bee balm. <laughs> it has her logo on there. You are the balm. <laughs> it's beeswax balm. This is a Let's see. Oh, the subscriber block is $5. This is $2 for this. You get a total value of $85. 
And then she's given us some breakdown on the actual items and I didn't see them until just now. So we'll, we'll go back to those. Oh, but I'm not done. We have easy chicken chili as our recipe of the month and I have not forgotten. I still have to go through these. By the way, I'm wearing my Creative Notions t-shirt. <laughs> All right, so curved scissors are very sharp and pointed to make snipping threads so much easier. You can also use these to unpick those pesky unplanned stitches. Duckbill scissors are available at a discount if you use your code at checkout. Duckbill scissors are used primarily for embroidery applique to snip away fabric and threads without cutting into embroidery. I use my duckbill scissors all the time when I'm at my embroidery machine because I'm doing applique. Um, and this has a different application, but she's like, you know, you can get the duckbill scissors if you want. This nice little point is really, really handy for lots of things besides just cutting it out. Now the hexagon, hexagon template set. Included in the hexagon set is a side triangle to make it so that you can be sewing into rows. Okay, that makes sense. Let me find something here. So she's talking about rows, so you can actually just go across row by row, because she's giving you the little teeny pieces that go in between there. All sets from three and a half inch on has a hole punched in them so they can be hung on the key ring. Hmm. So they can be hung on the ring provided. We've also sent a two and a half inch hexagon, which was in the February bag. That's why I don't remember, because it was two bags ago. Um, we made the matching side triangle for it and that is included in the set. However, there's no hole punched in it to it due to its size. Another set of hexagons will be added in a future bag. Yay! Embroidery border fabrics. Embroidered borders. These are cute borders that were made for the Sunflower Quilt Project. If you don't want to use them for borders, you can cut them up and use them in blocks or, or smaller squares for patchwork for zipper pouches and other fun creations. And she's talking about this. Embroidery will sometimes pull on the fabric from, si from the side slightly. If your border dips in slightly, try pulling across the grain as we do to straighten panels by using opposite corners at the section on the border that needs to be straightened. So and I run into this all the time. Sometimes things just get pulled a little bit you can kind of block it and straighten it and it's normal you see that and you can straighten it. Spray a little water on the opposite side of the embroidery and iron straight before uh, cutting it down if you want to do that. The embroidery is at least one half inch from the edge so there's a little tolerance for straightening if needed. Here in Utah the sunflowers are starting to appear very uh, soon, every field on the roadside will be covered. I remember, Vicki lives out in the country. It's so pretty, and they do have lots of wildflowers. The sunflowers and aqua coloring in this fabric is so bright and colorful, we think it's perfect for everyone. Side note, these are the colors of my kitchen. <laughs> With the sunflowers. <laughs> it's like, dang. Okay, UFOs, keep working on them. August is our birthday month and we will celebrate with prizes and gifts during our giveaways in the second Friday of August at 3 p.m. on our YouTube channel. So that's where this is a correction. The prizes will actually be on Friday, August 25th at 3 p.m. So tune into her YouTube channel. They are having um, a big party with giveaways and stuff and due to shipping delays, those won't get there so they're just pushing everything back. So. Friday the 25th. Mark that on your calendar right now. Um, keep working on your UFOs. August is our birthday month. Uh, watch them at Creative Notions on uh, YouTube. If you use Facebook and are in our group, post your finishes and tag us by using hashtag CNQS underscore UFO and we will be able to add you to our drawing. If you aren't using Facebook, then simply send your pictures of your finished quilts to our email, which is info at creativenotionsquiltshop.com or text it to 435-668-3425. Be sure to tell us your name. 
<laughs> very important block of the month and that's what this is let's see here the subscriber block of the month this year's block of the month will feature barn blocks we're excited to get started on these blocks with the july bag so exciting contest be sure to finish your projects as soon as you can so you can enter into the drawing for the prizes that we pick each month for our winners post pictures on our facebook group or email them to us at info at creative notions so we can put them on our page for you each winner wins a pre-cut of fabric all right so there's a note back here there is a code for discount for those who get her subscription to go on her website and then there's a little note in here a personal letter from vicky says i want to offer my sincere apologies for the lateness of the bags i know that you are all tired of being told that the products have not arrived we are in the at the mercy of our suppliers as our products are made specifically for us. Without these products, the bags are not coordinated and we want you to have a fully assembled bag when you receive it. In the past, I've said that the bags will be current with the July bag and this has not happened. We are always hopeful that the bags will be caught up and shipped on a certain date. We continue to work towards that goal. Rest assured that your bags will be shipped to you, albeit late. Currently, we don't have a system that suspends payments. Each one has to be done manually. We realize that some of you have paid for two to three bags ahead. If this is causing a problem, please email us for assistance. Uh, info at Creative Notions Quilt Shop. Um, and then she signed it Vicky. Now, something really cool. She is having a special sale that is not listed anywhere. Some people know about it and she told me and told me I can share with you guys. She is doing a huge sale on everything in her shop. It's 50% off, but you have to use a code. And unfortunately, she told me what it was. I was on my phone and I accidentally deleted the email swiping around and I'm not 100% sure if I have the right code. So if this does not work, call her. The code word is blowout. <laughs> We're gonna double check on that though. All right, so take advantage of that while you still can. I don't know how long she's gonna be doing it, but it is an amazing deal, kind of a secret shop thing going on. It is confirmed, the word is blowout. <laughs> Let's look at this fabric. It is so pretty. Like I said, these, these are the colors in my kitchen and I'm using sunflowers. So I have a feeling I might not be doing the quilt, <laughs> but I'll probably be doing something that will actually go in my kitchen with all of these. So let's look at them up close. Sunflower Suite, Lisa Audit. pretty pretty uh, these are gorgeous all right so there's our creative notions bag for may we have all kinds of fun things this just is adorable and we get everything's yellow has her label her net brown on it we've got yellow scissors we have bee balm we have a recipe we have uh, block of the month and an extra pattern using the block of the month we have the pattern of a quilt and table runner that is using all that fabric it also uses a um, four and a half inch and a five sorry there's a three and a four and a half inch hexagon set in here including the triangle piece and then they've included the two and a half inch triangle piece from a bag that was sent out in February. And I didn't, forgot about these. These fell out of my fabric, but these are two honey sticks. She always includes some kind of a sweet treat. <laughs> That's exactly what these are. And then the little bag itself is just adorable. 
and then you get a code for a discount but don't forget about the blowout code that's for everybody as long as she's running that sale 50 percent off go do it go check it out right now let me know what you think about this bag if you're subscribed to this and if you're not please do they're amazing the again tell her i sent you and that is it for this have a great day